all over America, a partnership has been established. It is not about the Occupy movement or Occupy the Dream. It is not about Occupy Education or Occupy the Dream. All of us are in the same boat now. Yeah. Yeah. And it is necessary for us to send a clear message across this country that enough is enough. Yeah. Yeah. And so I'm grateful for all of you who come out here today. This is not the end of the message. No. February right. 14th, which has historically been called Valentine's Day. <laughs> We're going to give a Valentine to America. <laughs> We're calling, the, the national movement is calling it Love Your Community Day. And on that day, we are asking people to go to your traditional financial institution and withdraw a minimum of $30, reinvest it in a credit union or minority owned business. Yeah. Woo! We are going to develop a list of those credit unions and minority owned banks because we want those institutions to understand if we're going to invest with you, you've got to invest with us. You talk about making a statement to Wall Street. You let Wall Street see in one day across this country that kind of money be moved. Yeah. I promise you, it'll wake them up. Yeah. If it does not wake them up, in March, we're going to begin to ask panalytic organizations, we're going to ask doctors and lawyers and business people and the church to begin to move your money from, from the traditional institutions, the, the Chase Banks, the Wells Fargo, the B of A, and move your money to a, or a bank or credit union that wants to work with the 99%. Yeah. Yeah. I believe today is the beginning of a new movement that marries with a present movement to make a difference all across this country. Thank you for your participation, your support. Don't let anybody fool you. We made a difference here today. Yeah. 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 Living God is what makes the difference. Yeah, yeah. We close out in prayer. Amen. In your own tradition, whatever your faith tradition is, would you join us? Yeah. God of our weary years, God of our silent tears, Yahweh, Jehovah, Lord God, we pause to thank you for the marriage in the mood. Now God, we give you thanks that today was a peaceful day. And on the day that this nation and the world celebrates the life of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., we thank you for the birth of a marriage that we believe is going to change the course of history. God bless the 99%. Help the 1% to understand that it's about all of us. God, keep the movement strong and covered by your protection. And we say thank you. Thank you. In your name, Father, we pray. And the people who believe change is going to come said, Amen. Amen. Come on, put your hands together. Thank you. Now let's go get warm. <laughs> All right. That's good. Thank you, Pastor's great words. Good, yeah. Did you capture all that? All right, good. Oh, yeah. So we're down here at 101 Market Street. Yeah. <laughs> Occupy the dream. That's right. Although I got a funny feeling that this crowd's going to thin out yeah, real yeah. soon. Right. So I'm going to go ahead and end this live stream uh, today. Uh, to, I'll be uh, live streaming tomorrow from here at 101 Market Street.
at 6 p.m. for General Assembly. So that's 6 p.m. tomorrow, Tuesday, where we'll be having General Assembly. And I'd like to thank you for watching, and we'll talk. We'll be back together soon.